I'm Audra Stafford here at the Old Globe in San Diego where I got a chance to speak with the legendary Burt Bacharach and Tony winner Steven Sater about their brand new world premiere musical. Some Lovers is a new musical I've been writing with Burt that we've been working on for a few years. It's a, it's a love story. How do you give to someone else the thing that means most to yourself? This love story follows a couple over two decades. You see this couple in their 20s, and you see them in their 40s. And the man is a composer, and there's a man in his 40s looking back on the young man he was in his 20s, writing all these songs full of ambition, and this woman who feels like, who's gone through this, these years with him, and feels like he's taken her heart and made it into his songs. It's a New York love story too. I mean, you know, it's where it happens in New York. And uh, as Stephen just said, it's about what happens to relationships. How do you sustain? Lovers features nearly two dozen new songs. And writing them has truly been a labor of love for the creators. This whole experience for me is like, a, well I said, it's like a dream come true. You write these words and you really care about them. And then you arrive at Bert's house and he puts them to music in a way you could have never imagined and never dreamed. Here it goes. Stephen writes uh, quite extraordinary, quite brilliant. Everything is really important, important, and f fast. I don't know anybody that writes this fast. Be that good and write that fast, <laughs> amazing. Bacharach's first original musical in more than 40 years. It's been since 19, what, 68? Since Promises by Time. I like being back in the, the world of theater. There is a certain kind of license that you can get away with that you might not want to, say, going in with a recording artist. We found a way that the songs are performative, so people can actually be performing songs in the context of the play, and that's nice. That too gives us a license and a liberty yeah. about the kind of songs we can write and the kind of performers we can have performing them. Now, I've seen this, you know, numerous run-throughs, and I find myself, most of the time, by the end, really kind of touched. It's a hard one to say about something you're involved with writing, and, but I do. 